Honorable member for Mandera Central. Order honorable members. Order honorable Bowen and your group. Honorable members, I direct that uh, having garnered the requisite support numbers, this motion of adjournment will be moved at the end of the business at order number 12 or at 5.30, whichever comes earlier. Are we together, honorable member? At the end of the business at order number 12 or at 5.30, whichever comes earlier. Next order. Order number seven, questions and statements. Next. Order number eight, procedural motion, reduction of publication period of a specified bill. Chairperson, Budget and Appropriations Committee. Thank you very much, uh, Honorable Speaker. Honorable Speaker, I wish to move that pursuant to the provisions of Standing Order 120, that this House resolves to reduce the publication period of the supplementary appropriations, appropriation number three bill, National Assembly Bill number 71 of 2023, from seven days to four days. And, Honorable Speaker, the essence of this, as the uh, members are aware, there is nothing much happening in, in, in regards to government. And that is affecting actually this house just like any other agency of government. Because when there is a um, process like the one we are under undertaking now for supplementary estimates, as members are aware, the system of government, famously known as IFMIS, usually does not operate. And the reason for this, Honorable Speaker, is usually because some of the effects we are making on the budget some MDS could proceed, for example, to expect the money, monies probably which have already been proposed for cuts. So the essence of actually locking in quotes the IFMIS is usually for tidiness of government financials because the process we are undertaking now is to vary the budget. And we cannot now be expecting the same monies that we are varying. So the essence of this motion is for us to be able to conclude the debate in regards to appropriations bill today, and henceforth then conclude the matter of supplementary estimate so that then we can free up resources to go into our CDF, to go into our roads, to go into our water, for parliament to operate, and any other uh, government agency. And Honorable Speaker, I request the very eloquent member for Kerenyaga, Honorable Jerry, to second. Any eloquence here? Just Honorable second. Speaker, I, <laughs> I rise to second and I thank uh, my very good friend and uh, role model to many of the young politicians, Honorable Ndindi Nyoro, the member for Kiharu. Uh, Honorable Speaker, indeed, we need um, the country to be able to operate and I am seeking that once um, this is done, Treasury releases the funds with immediate effect so that we can um, get back to work. Thank you, Honorable Speaker. Thank you, Njeri. Honorable members, I now propose the question that pursuant to the provision of Standing Order 120, this House resolves to reduce the publication period of the supplementary appropriation number three bill, National Assembly Bill number 71 of 2023, from seven days to four days. Is that the mood of the House? I'll now put the question, which is that pursuant the provision of Standing Order 120, this House resolves to reduce the publication period of the supplementary appropriation number three bill, National Assembly Bill number 71 of 2023 from seven days to four days. As members of that opinion say aye. aye. Will those of the contrary opinion say nay? The ayes have it. Order, Honorable Mwenje, before